Well, the journey started really well. Now we're stuck in traffic. Excellent stuff. Can you do anything in life without being stuck in traffic? Take a bike. I'm a big fan of that. Would have helped if we hadn't left maybe at 11. We'd left at 9 instead. Oh, there's Coco. Hello. Hey, Cokes. You're not best pleased at having to be moved from the back either, are you? Huh? And there's Lily. <laughs> so, yeah, just got to go to Costa Rama and then it's on to Evian, which is on Lake Geneva. Hopefully, it's not quite as busy as it is here. I think you're going to be disappointed. I think I am. I suspect it might off. be quite busy. The great thing about doing van life is that generally you don't have to do things at weekends. You um, stick well clear of anywhere where there are likely to be a lot of people. Have we got all that Christmas shopping done? What do you mean, have we? I may have done some. Oh, it's snowing! Well, yeah, actually, the traffic. That's Snow has arrived. You watch, all this mucking around, all this traffic, and I won't have what I need. Success with the insulation. So yes, we're now going to disappear over to Evian. It's meant to be really, really nice there. And we might, might even, maybe not tonight, maybe tomorrow, go into Montreux. Being this time of year is definitely what you want to be doing. That's if we can park the van anyway. So, let's go. On your butt. Coco, Coco, your head's stuck. How was your product runs? Yes, now it's stuck. But I might panic. <laughs> Coco, Coco. So yeah, we're now in uh, Evian. Um, some of these sculptures, these wooden sculptures, are just, they're just mad. Look at that, that's a cow. It's more like a door to me. Le Fabulous Village is the name of the event. Yeah, trying to find somewhere to park here is going to be a right old issue. There's a couple of camping cars there. It's so for camping cars. That's oh, yeah. yeah, see, look, no one parking there except for camping cars. Oh, yeah. First time yeah. I've ever seen something for just camping cars. Oh, it's a miracle. What the hell has happened? We're not used to this kindness. No. <laughs> and then they clamp you because you haven't. Oh, hey. We have motorhome places purely for us to make you feel special. Mind you, will that play against us? Why? Except for camping cars, and they'll be like, yeah, you're not a camping car, you're a van. Yeah, but then we can just open the door up and say, look, there's a, there's a bed, there's a sink, there's a kitchen, there's mm -hmm. a toilet, there's a shower. What part of this not being in a camper van are you confused about? No, I'm just saying from their point of, you know, from their point of view, like we always say, oh, well, we're not a camping car, we're a van. <laughs> we're we're so a car van, not a camping car. Well, then you can't park here, but we are a camping car, <laughs> so you can't park with a van's car. We are a camping car. It's a mixed up world. It'd be even better if it's free, and hopefully we can even... Um, Okay. Get a red down here tonight. Well, is it on park for night? Don't know. Let's have a look. Probably have a race going on here, so you can get onto park for night the quickest. Well, you'll win. My I friend's so nice slow. Time. Yeah, no, it's. No. Yeah, it looks like it. Hold on. Well, it's got a 3.4 out of 5. One kilometre from the centre, parking at the port. Super nice for the night. Oh, good. Free from 7 o'clock to 8 o'clock. No service. You have to be lucky to get one of these spa three spaces. Woohoo! Good God. They say, they say, oh, we, we didn't stay for the night as we prefer to stay somewhere more out of reach. Fuck, you can't please people. You really can't. <laughs> no, I've actually got here. I don't want to get out and cold. Approximately once every six weeks, my hair looks all right. So I'm not wearing a hat. But now I'm paying for it because I'm frozen. First things first though, it's it's freezing here and uh, so we're gonna go and find ourselves a coffee we'll wait for dark because I think all the lights come on at night onto the sculptures and it all gets a bit magical or I'm hoping it does anyway
interesting. Haven't seen something like this before. Um, but it's freezing, so I think we're going to go and get a van shawl now. Sounds like a pretty good plan to me. Gonna have to be a quick one because I've got football to watch. All the little, uh, the restaurants have got their own little like kind of tiki huts outside. Now this place, they were very hospitable to us. Uh, it's called the uh, Tiki Blinder. Tiki, the tiki Blinder. Tiki Blinders. It's in Evian, and we had a particularly good chocolate shawl with kirsch. Okay, so very nice to be back in the van after a very cold walk back. As you can see, Christmas tree has actually lasted the test of time. It's we have still lost in one piece. About six baubles though. <laughs> is it that many? Yeah. Is there well, some is well, there some you didn't tell me no, about? No, to be fair, they're not actually lost. They actually just fell off and I thought there's no point in putting them back on because they're only gonna fall off again, so they've gone in gone by in. lantern. Um, but anyway, we're just going to have some dinner um, and try and get it done before the game. Don't, I've got a knife, you haven't. Okay, well, England lost. Uh, standard, really. Oh God, the amount of ribbon I'm gonna get this week. Anyway, football's done, we're fed, and the dogs are pretty comfortable now, so. Netflix. Netflix, yeah. Yeah, it's time to watch Wednesday. That's what we're watching at the moment is Wednesday. If you've not watched it. We're really it, enjoying it actually. It's really good, yeah. isn't it? It's, I think a... it was a mistake today to not wear my hat. I have an earache. So I've got a Charlotte with earache giving me earache about her having earache. It's a shame you didn't lose your voice as much as, <laughs> you know, get an earache. That'd be great. Anyway, uh, it's good night from us and um, see you in the morning. we'll see you in the morning. Lily does want egg. <laughs> Not that much since she's standing up for it. <laughs> look at the size of that tongue, my god, look at it. <laughs> okay, so we just taken the dogs for a walk, that's ticking the box. Um, had our coffee, done everything we needed, so we're now going to do one to Montreux. Do just one what? Do one. Well, you know, don't. We shall leave and go to Montreux. Okay, then we shall leave and go to Montreux rather than do one. So yeah, let's get going. Right, are we set? Yep. Yep. Okay. Let's go. Because it's so cold, I'm just going to get one of the dogs in the uh, in the basket. It's not only that; it's just very, very busy here. We've only literally just got here. We don't want our dogs to be trampled on. And um, now I've got to pick up Coco. I think it's time for a nice little montage to get you in the Christmas spirit. Okay, get you ready for your Christmas days. So um, yeah, there's a, a minute or two of this marketplace. What a feeling, now it's time for Christmas And Christmas is my favorite time of year 
It's beginning to look like all my wishes are coming true. That's why I cheer. I've been busy decking the halls. I've been kind to big and small, and now it's time to have a merry holiday. What a feeling when it's time for Christmas. Let's sing a carol and we'll bring it here. I guess that spring and summer they're all fine. But I've been waiting for the season that's mine. So let it come, yeah, let it come. I think most of today's budget's gone on hot drinks. This place is enormous. It's way bigger than I thought. There's so much stuff going on here. Um, so many stalls. This place is absolutely phenomenal. Everywhere you go, you can see this over here. There's all these purpose-built stalls everywhere. The place is absolutely nuts. It's great. It's taken us ages just to walk from one end to the other. We're still not even there yet, and we've been walking about an hour. The other thing here as well is that you could spend an absolute fortune. It's not just generic stuff from China. It's just all handmade stuff. And um, yeah, you, you could really do a ton of money here. You really could. Okay, so now we're really hungry and uh, we come to this inside bit, which is pretty much all food. Um, I'm in my element because I'm never, never not hungry and I'm currently really, really starving. So, but it's everything. We'll give you a little tour around and then we'll show you what we're going to have. Let's sing a carol and we'll bring it here. Let's sing a carol and we'll bring it. Okay, so completely gave up on getting food in there. Super, super busy. So yeah, we're just going to head back to the van. There's a few places to eat on the way back and hopefully the queues ain't so big. <laughs> One thing I really love doing at Christmas is getting roasted chestnuts. I've never had roasted chestnuts done in this way before. Merci. Bonne journée. Merci beaucoup. We're now back at the van after a very long walk. A very, very, very good Christmas market. I just wish we'd bought more money. I suppose that's van life for you. Um, when you're living in a small space, you can't go buying everything. Um, you can eat everything. Well, you can. I usually do. Within reason. <laughs> I usually do. So hopefully you will have a lovely Christmas. Happy holidays. Hope you have a good time over the next week or so. Be with your family. Love them. Love your friends. Enjoy some food. Keep warm. Happy Bye. Christmas.